friends. Welcome back. Today we're going to read the story Pete the Cat and his four groovy buttons. The author of today's story is Eric Litwin. He wrote the story, the words, and our illustrator is James Dean. And what does the illustrator do again? Oh yeah, that's right. He draws the pictures. But with that, I'm going to put this book down because I have a special treat for this story today. So I'm going to put this down. I'm going to lower the camera a bit and then we'll begin. Today, we're going to use our flannel board for Pete the Cat and his four groovy buttons. So, some things we need to know first. Up here, it says, pop, oh no. So, every time I point up here, I need you to help me try saying that. Ready? Can we try it? Pop, oh no. Good job. And here are some musical notes. That means we're going to be singing. So, when I point to these, we're going to be singing part of his song. Down here, we have some math or some numbers. And first of all, it's gonna show us a numeral, a big numeral in the middle. And what's that numeral? That's right, that's the number three. And then they write the word right up here. They spell the word out, three. Down here, we have a math problem and it says four minus one equals three. That, one, that minus sign kind of looks like the dash we use when we're writing our date, doesn't it? But it's not, in math, it's called minus. And two dashes together like that means equal. Okay, shall we begin? Okay, here we go. Pete the Cat put on his favorite shirt with four big, colorful, round, groovy buttons. He loved his shirt so much, he sang a song. My buttons, my buttons, my four groovy buttons. My buttons, my buttons, my four groovy buttons. Ready? Oh no, one button fell off and rolled away. How many buttons are left? Three. Four minus one equals three. Did Pete cry? Goodness, no. Buttons come and buttons go. And he kept on singing his song. My buttons, my buttons, my three groovy buttons. My buttons, my buttons, my three groovy buttons. Pop! Oh no! Another button popped off and rolled away. How many buttons were left? Two. Three minus one equals two. Did Pete cry? Goodness, no. He just kept on singing his song. My buttons, my buttons, my two groovy buttons. My buttons, my buttons, my two groovy buttons. Pop! Oh no! Another button popped off and rolled away. How many buttons are left? One. Two minus one equals one. Did Pete cry? Goodness, no! Buttons come and buttons go. And he kept on singing his song. My button, my button, my one groovy button. My button, my button, my one groovy button. Pop! Oh no! The last button popped off and rolled away. How many buttons were left? Zero. One minus one equals zero. Did Pete cry? Goodness, no. Buttons come and buttons go. Pete looked down at his buttonless shirt. And what do you think he saw? His belly button! <laughs> and he kept on singing his song. My button, my button, still have my belly button. My button, my button, still have my belly button. I guess it simply goes to show that buttons come and buttons go. But do we cry? Goodness, no. We just keep on singing our song. Buttons come and buttons go. Thank you, friends, for visiting. I hope you like our story with Pete the Cat today. See you on Thursday.